Hey, I'm C Dinky. And in today's video, at the recording of this video, 10 hours ago, Grounded has released a GIF on their Twitter saying, tap the GIF to see which new weapon in the Grounded Fully Yoked Edition is yours. And funnily enough, as you can see in the image on screen now, I got the fresh battle axe for my very first time doing this, which is pretty surprising as I do like my fresh elemental weapons and the sail battle axe, so this is just perfect for me. Not only did they release the fresh edge into the game, so we actually have a picture of it now, they also released all of the new elemental weapons and all of the reskin elemental weapons coming into Grounded 1.4. Now let's go ahead and talk about the new fresh elemental weapons coming. We see here on screen the fresh battle axe, which is just like the sour battle axe, just reskinned to fresh. We also have here the teased fresh tier 4 greatsword, along with the tier 4 battle axe as well. I'm only speculating that the greatsword and the new battle axe are going to be tier 4, considering I do not think the devs are going to do a reskin of the old weapons and just classify them as tier 4. I'm pretty sure all the tier 4 weapons are going to have a different weapon look overall. And now I'm going to call this now in this video if the fresh battle axe has the attack speed buff just like the sour battle axe it is going to destroy the infected broodmother. Now we have gone over all the new fresh weapons that are coming into Granite 1.4 let's go ahead and show all the new spicy weapons coming into Granite 1.4. So here we have the spicy mace, the wallapino, the spicy axe, and as well, the spicy battle axe. It is a little bit odd they have two spicy busting weapons as well as two spicy chopping weapons, but I can see why they have the two spicy chopping weapons as these are going to be the spider destroyers as chopping and spicy like literally eliminates all spiders in the game. And from the PAX reveal trailer, all of us thought that the Wallapino was going to be the tier three equivalent of the mint mace just in spicy version. But no, as you can see here, we do now have the spicy mace, I'm not sure how good these spicy weapons are going to be outside of spiders. I guess we'll have to wait and see. So once again, we have gone over all of the spicy weapons. Let's now go over all of the new sour weapons. And I can confirm there are going to be four of them coming into Granted 1.4. And these guys are the sour katana, the sour mace, the sour mallet, as well as a two-handed sour sword, which looks very similar to the scrapped earwig sword. I'm only saying that because the blade is all bendy, just like the earwig sword. Bit surprised we got four different sour weapons, not just a few, as there's not many creatures in the game that are weak to sour. I'm pretty sure it's just Director Schmecta and the Black Widows, but I could be wrong here. And if you caught on it, you can see the Fire Ant Queen pheromone gems are inside of the sour earwig sword, meaning we're going to need to go ahead and either befriend, kill, or do the third option for the Fire Ant Queen to be able to get this weapon. And don't worry, there is a salty weapon coming into Grand 1.4. The devs haven't completely gotten rid of salty in the game. So what you guys get is a singular salty pickaxe, which is probably going to be tier 4. You guys don't get any of the reskin tier 3s in a different element. You're just getting the salty pickaxe as of right now. And the reason why I think it's only getting one weapon is I don't think the devs classify salt as a candy, so it's not going to have any of the other candy weapons, I guess. And that is all of the new weapons coming into Grand 1.4. But the video is not done yet. I still have a little bit I would like to talk about. Out. I'm going to think that Hardened Sprig, a cut content item from Grounded, is going to come back in New Game Plus somehow. As we can see in a bunch of the different tier 4 weapons, it has some sort of like birch or like wooden handle, and the Hardened Sprig looks exactly like it, so I'm pretty sure we're going to see Hardened Sprig in New Game Plus. As if you didn't already catch it, or if you don't know, all these new elemental weapons are going to be in New Game Plus only. And I would also like to think that all the new tier 4 weapons are going to have some sort of new elemental effect once you upgrade it down level 6, or it might have two damage types like the cut earwig sword which had slashing and stabbing damage and if this is true i'm going to think that the new fresh and sour two-handed weapons are going to have the slashing and stabbing damage type possibly the new fresh and spicy battle axes are going to have the chopping and slashing damage type the new salty pickaxe could also have a stabbing busting damage type as we don't know the other end of the pickaxe it might be a blunt end and now finally when it comes down to the sour and spicy mallets i'm pretty sure these guys are just going to have busting as i don't see any sharp edges so slashing chopping or even stabbing will not work with these guys but the devs might possibly have a new damage type up their sleeve so i guess we'll have to wait for what these weapons are going to have in 1.4 now i'm not going to keep you guys for too much longer but if you guys like to comment down your ideas on what these new tier 3 or tier 4 elemental weapons might be please let me know down below in the comments and if you made it this far into the video please make sure to leave a like and subscribe i would really appreciate it, it helps out this channel a lot and i'll catch you guys in the next video